All right, folks. Hey, if you guys want to get a nice roof done, Jen's son, Haven, Jersey, will come out and do your job for you. Look how nice this one came out. Not like all the other places. They, You call them, you leave a message. They don't call back because they're either too busy or they don't care to do your job. They don't want to come down and give you an estimate. They don't want to give you any kind of estimate because they don't really want your job. Because maybe they have too much work already or they don't need your jobs. But Jensen called me back the next day, told me they'll give me an estimate. They took like an aerial footage of it. They measured it. They tell you what the peaks are. They tell you what you need. The flashing around the chimneys. All these other vents here. They give you a nice price. They come down. The parts are delivered the day before. There's a dump truck or a dump trailer that comes in the day before. And the crew gets here around 7 and they go to work. The crew's about 7 people. Okay? Non stop work. Non stop. If they stop for lunch for like 20 minutes, they take turns taking lunch. So there's always a crew working all the time. Always. Okay? And if you guys don't know anything about roofing, do, do a little homework on your roofing. Because the roofing that was done on this house. It was only about 10 to 12 years ago, and it was already leaking. It wasn't the material, because the material was still nice and soft and pliable. The problem was the installation, the way they installed it. Okay, but SunGen, look what they did here. They put a nice edge molding that you're supposed to have, because the older one, I was able to see the plywood in there. Then they didn't do the uh, ice barrier on the bottom there right where the gutters are, okay? Because when, like I said, when you lifted up the shingles, I was able to see black tar paper and the plywood itself. They didn't have the edge, they didn't have the ice barrier, so that's why it leaked down over there. But the main problem was basically in that valley, when they did the extension over there, and probably around the uh, chimney, we're assuming, that's the problem and was coming down. But anyway, I'm happy with the job. If you guys are interested in having a roof done, give Jen son a nice call. All right. I'll see if I can attach the uh, the website to you for it. But like I said, beautiful job. Non-stop. The crew comes here. They cleaned up everything. You you can't even tell that there was a uh, there was work done. Okay. They put the tops around there. So when they take the old shingles off, goes down the top. Just like a slide and ends up on the top down on the bottom they clean it up they use a magnet a big wide one they go around the whole property then they have a little small magnet and they go through all the flower pots and everything just to get all the nails all right and it's a beautiful job all right let me let me see if i can show you what's down over there by the gutters all right And here's that edge molding I told you about. The original one had the siding come up and then make a little turn, and that was it. There was nothing that goes this way. So if the water was gonna get forced in, it would went in that way and would have came down. So there's a little L like that, a little edge molding. Goes all the way around the house, all around the roof. Good job. Here it is with a new gutter. Yeah. Like I said, didn't have that in the old roof. That pissed me off. All right. That black stuff I put on there when I was looking for my leak. 
otherwise it's not needed. All right, that's it. Look at that. You can see the ridge vents up there, the chimney. All done. Good job. Thanks, Jensen. Ciao. If you use them, mention my name here in Al Yonkuda. All right, thanks. Ciao. Oh, and don't forget about the roof vents. Okay, you can add that along the whole length of the roof. That's to get all the hot air out from the top. Not sure if you guys have a chimney, I mean a uh, attic fan. But yep, it goes underneath and it runs right across. All right, they take it right to the end of the roof. A lot of places would stop about maybe 15 inches before, but they run the whole length all the way around on every peak. All right, even a little tiny one up there. Every little bit helps. Guess the hot air that's in there and out. All right. Let's travel down. Yep, they put new caps around all the pipes. Excellent. Nice straight line coming down in the valley. All right, let's go check it out. 